to a very rare occurrence here we're about ready to go into a estate sale on our monday we don't i don't think we've ever been to a estate sale on a monday so we're gonna go in see what they have how'd you get it stamped hall yeah hall's a it's like a little dish all right ask them what this is yeah just a porcelain thing i don't know what that is you know what it's chipped i can see the chip now oh yeah, mm. yeah. I'm gonna put this in the back this doll's pretty cool. Is it? It says this little duck. Look at that little duck. Oh, yeah. That is a cute little duck. These thermoses are always nice. What do you, what do you think that's used for? I think that's the name. But look at the pottery. It's like Wilson pottery. It's like glazed, glazed on the inside. Yeah, it's like another little pan thing. And that's like a bunt pan. Like a. I, I, yeah, I guess. Like a ceramic bunt pan? Yeah, it's pretty neat. I don't know. It's still, I mean, OE isn't old. Does it say South Carolina? Yeah. I don't know. It's neat though. Just empty things, right? Yeah, these right here. Yeah. If they weren't empty, I'd definitely be getting this old Tiffany and Company one. <laughs> what do you think would go in there? Like a watch band? Um, I think some sort of silver, like a silver knife or something. But I don't really know. Look at the old black and decker. It's got no markings. Huh. I put that dish back. I just remember I have a bunch of that. Oh, that's pretty good. I'm going to buy the whole thing. Oh, that's what I did. Oh, they're nice. They're they? Made in Italy. You like stuff made in Italy. I did. Yeah. Got some Pyrex in here. That's the pottery. It's worth a ton of money, but oh, well, Cosé's not bad. Oh yeah. Did you see that? What is it? Oh yeah, no. no. Mm -mm, it's just the base. Oh, uh, we need to see how much these are. These are Ferragamos. Huh. And there's a ton of them. Really? Yeah, look, Ferragamos. Ferragamos. Salvatore Ferragamo. There's Bailey's. So in this room, we do go through all the shoes. We do pick up four pairs of uh, Salvatore Ferragamos. Also, we picked up a pair of these really cool wooden like men that go for like $20 a piece. Gala in a random bag found a vintage old timer knife. It was a trapper knife, goes for about $25. I do pick up this old uh, shoe shining kit right there. Anytime I can pick up like shoe shining cloths, I always pick them up. And then Kayla did pick up this really cool blanket that she found in a linen closet. Everything we paid again was for $50, so we did really, really well. Then after that, we hit some Goodwills. What do you think? It's signed. I feel like for $3.99. Can't get wrong with this. Is everyone the same person? Mm -hmm. Really? Look at that thing. The only information I could find on this train is that it went for $105 and there are none in stock. Oh, it's got a crack in it. Yep. Good eye. Speed up right there. That's a big, tightless bag. 
So the first bag I looked at was an Ojo bag. It was pretty beat up, but Ojo is a really good name brand to look out for. But this is an old Titleist made in the United States Sunday bag. The Sunday bags are usually small, lightweight bags where you can just put a couple clubs in. And I'm definitely going to pick this up. I think it was $6.99 there at the Goodwill. And this is easy, $45 to $50 in that condition. They were for only $7 or $6.99. Yeah, that is really, really cool. 100% buy this. These things are usually 50, 60 bucks easy. Oh, it's the same thing that's in here. A whole bunch of pumpkins. What is this? A little croquette. What is this? I don't know. It looks like it would be something. That doesn't go with it, I would guess. What is this? 2000s audio. It's a big audio stand. So this was a speaker stand, and they were asking $25 for it. So I did look it up, and it was actually worth 60 brand new, so I left it behind. These are Paragon Controls for appliances. That's a big timer. Huh. The old bowling ball. Tiny man. Some of these go for good money. Oh, that's gonna be a hole in it. A cigarette burn. What is this that you found? Oh, it's like a woman's. It's a woman's pet. Probably means petite. Yeah, it's like a denim. Not denim. Um, yeah. It's pretty nice. Yeah. Nylon. Doesn't feel like nylon. That's pretty cool. Stop her. Right? The North Face West Sack. It's actually in pretty good condition. Six bucks though. Hmm. Have to look that up. Oh, a little tailor. Oh, it's probably not tailor made. Well, it probably is. Yeah, they're usually embroidered, so. That's great. This thing feels heavy. Nothing there but the... the... Old Peppa. Good old Peppa tie. With the dinosaur. The plushes are usually holding other animals. They're worth more money. But we'll, we'll put Peppa back. I just found a Dooney and Burke red purse here. They're like four bucks. And this is probably the first purse that I'm actually going to buy. Not too bad. Kayla says it's a good one. The lady put it down right in front of me, so I had to pick it up quick, but not too bad. It feels... Oh, it's like suction. I, I thought it was super heavy. Turns out just, it's just suction to the... <laughs> it feels light, actually. But how many uh, processors come with suction cups? Comes with the top. Comes with the thing. Fairly clean. It's annoying with the... These remind me of uh, going on vacation at the IHOP. This guy, he's pretty nice. Got the old dent in him. So the old Dernie and Burke, actually, Kayla just looked it up. This is called like a fluoride? Florence, not fluoride. $500 brand new. And it's like 130 used. We have to authenticate it, I guess, but that's still not back. 23. 18. That's not even worth 30. Oh, 39 is not bad for four bucks. 22. Uh, the cord's all dirty. It took me forever to get the cord clean. What is this thing from George Foreman? It's ten dollars though. What is that? I have no idea. All right. Take my purse and get out of here. We got some stickers to go over, so let's go ahead and go over. We got San Francisco in the house. LaMonica, thank you so much for all the cool things. 
Alcatraz, The Rock. I watched that movie. That's pretty good. And also the Golden Gate Bridge there. And really awesome. Thank you so much. This stuff will be up on the toolbox and a sticker is heading your way. Thank you so much for Papa and Cat. What a cool sticker right here. Papa's mix up and corner. Visit us on eBay. There you go. Thank you so much. That is awesome. Richard and his wife, thank you so much. Y'all said that you were tired. United States Marines, thank you so much for your service. And also, uh, Kayla's dad is United States Marine. So I will go ahead and give one of these to him, and one will go up on my toolbox. And thank you so much for Brett for this really cool machine sticker. You said you got it at like a uh, convention. You're like, who can I send this to? And you thought, of course, the thrift machine. Thank you so much. Everybody here will be getting a sticker in your mailbox soon. So really not that bad. We did not think we were gonna hit an estate sale that day. There are never estate sales on Mondays. Like never, 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 never. We went down there. You really couldn't see a whole bunch we were uh, getting because the GoPro kept messing up and it was kind of dark in there. So, but we did get like four Ferragamo shoes and a whole bunch of those little pottery pieces. Got some good knives. We threw the soul comps up on the screen. So we did really well. Everything we got there was only for 50 bucks. And we also got this really cool blanket. I'll also throw that up there too and uh, throw the soul comp up. And that alone goes for like 30 bucks. So I think we four times to five times our money on that one. And the Goodwills, we got to hit the Goodwills just because there's not a lot of yard sales. This is like four days later because we've actually done a storage unit between the time this video comes out and the other videos. And the next two videos are gonna be a storage unit video. We had to call back up. Dad came in with his truck and we just needed all the help we could get on this one. I bit off a little bit more than I could chew in the time frame I had to chew it in. So I do appreciate it. Watch it tomorrow. If you're not subscribed, subscribe, comment down below, like the video. All of that is for free and it helps the channel out. And you know I will always catch you on the next one.